So I showed you how to make the best fall recipe ever, which is this apple cinnamon honey wine. But today I'm going to give you a few extra tips to help make sure you get the best results. Let's start with sanitizing your equipment. This is probably the most important part, but don't let it intimidate you because it's simple. All you need is a food grade sanitizer, like Star Sand is popular for home brewing. And what I do is mix it in a bucket with water and literally just dunk all of your equipment and you're good to go. You don't even need to rinse it. The second tip is adding sodium or potassium metabisulfite, also known as Campton tablets. These come in tablets that you crush up and then add to your meat, and they impart sulfur dioxide into your mix, which kills and prevents the spread of bacteria. I recommend adding them when the risk of introducing bacteria is high, so like at the beginning of the batch and then when I transfer containers. And this is really just a preventative measure to reduce the chances of your batch going bad. And the last thing I'd like to touch on is the addition of yeast nutrients. This isn't 100% necessary, but it's a good way to ensure your yeast are getting everything they need to support a healthy and strong fermentation. This comes in a powder and I will add it at the same time that I add my yeast. And this just helps prolong the life and maximize the alcohol production of your yeast. So I hope these tips help. I have other videos that go into much more detail with all this stuff. But let me know if you have any questions or if there's anything else you'd like to see.